Good early morning everybody and welcome on back to the channel. I'm so excited because I'm taking Amy white bass fishing for the first time ever today. First time going out within the bass boat by herself with that. And today's video is sponsored by our friends at Mystery Tackle Box. If you're looking to grow your tackle arsenal, MTB is the best way to do it and you're going to pay a lot less than you would in the stores. I've been partnered with MTB for years. They are a great partner and they also make the perfect gift for the fishermen in your circle. And after all these years, I'm still surprised by all the new tackle that I see in the boxes every month. They have tons of connections in the tackle world now. In every box, you're getting a great mix of hard baits, soft plastics, terminal tackle, and you're even getting Guggen Squad hard baits and plastics in there, so it is juicy. They have boxes for everybody, whether you're a beginning fisherman or you're looking for that next level elite box, and they have different species boxes as well, so they've got you covered. So for as little as 20 bucks a month, you get tons of new baits, brand name lures delivered straight to your door. So get started with your first mystery tackle box. The link is down in the description, guys. Use my code MONDO and you will save $10 off your first box. That is M-O-N-D-O. Thanks, MTV, for sponsoring today's video. Now on with the show. Milk. You got your milk. You ready to go fishing with Daddy? Yeah. Yes, I am. All right, what are you going to catch today? A bat and a bluegill. All right. All right, Amy, it's your big day on the lake. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. You already got to see your first on the water sunrise right here. You just got to find some fish. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. What? The sunrise? Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Yeah, it's always prettier on the water. Daddy's got to back the boat in the lake, and I just want you to sit right here while I do that, okay? Can you put this on for me? Uh -huh. It's got this really cool pink and purple green life jacket. Feel good? Uh -huh. All right. Okay. Say, so everybody, start your engines. Everybody, start your engines. <laughs> Yeah, it is Daddy's secret little compartment. Okay, Amy. So last time when you went fishing with your little Moana pole here, remember you caught a bass? Uh huh. And we caught some bluegill. That's right. Amy got her first. Her first bass was a spotted bass, a good size one. She caught it on this little ice fishing jig that I actually got out of, out of a mystery tackle box a long time ago, a little panfish box. And today, well, that is a surprise. You're going to be fishing with a, a bigger lure today. I'm going to let you pick it out. Which one would you like to fish with? I knew you were going to pick that one. I knew. Rainbow. It is a rainbow color. Amy chose this one because it is a rainbow color. It's actually a good color, though. We'll be ready. All right, Amy, we're out past the no wake zone. That means we can go fast. How fast do you want to go? Um, super. You want to go super fast? Huh? You better hang on to Unicorn if you want to go super fast. Are you strapped in? Are you ready? Yeah. Holding on? Well, 
well guys we've got a tired one dad's not doing his job getting on these things quick enough the evening bite's really good it's just like right at dinner bath time that mom was uh initially opposed to but i think we're gonna I think we're gonna we're gonna rally we're gonna have a rally right maybe go in get a little breakfast Round one, fish one. You know, I was thinking I have to get this done quickly with with the toddler. Gotta have, you know, we got a short attention span, we gotta get on the action quick. And I thought in the mornings we would get a little bit of schooling action. I mean, I saw it the other day when I was catfishing. Totally not happening today, it was, it's 94 degrees right now. 8.40 in the morning, so. Uh, it's just stagnant, hot, fish are all scattered. You could troll for them, but that's not fun. Uh, didn't want to get on the crappie piles and do that. I mean, it's just, you know, it's a little too much. I need uh, maybe a schooling on top or schooling on the bottom. Doesn't matter. We just need schooling, heavy feeding. Um, and that usually happens in the summertime in the evenings. You might have to bring this. Getting ready for round two right now. What do I need to bring? Earplugs? Because oh. it might be getting them in, in your ears. That was, this was for the airboat Daddy went on. You didn't see that. That was really loud. So... It was, it was just like that. Yeah, it was really fast. You're like, turbo speed. <laughs> Look at that. Goodness, you're so fast your hat flew off. <laughs> Alright. You're going to be so fast, the fish won't know what to do with you. Ready for round two? Yeah. But my mom's going to come. I'm having flashbacks of when we took you up to Arkansas one time. And you were just a little bitty girl. Got on the boat with mommy and daddy. And then we've got the queen. I might as well have a suitcase with me. The queen of the lake. Stepping up, Crocs are, Crocs are perfect for this. Oh. Woo! It's been a long Same time in. since I've been on this boat. So. We're gonna try to get us on the fish. Alright. So, everybody buckle in, put your life vests on. We're heading to the dangle. Amy, your hair after those boat rides is so silly. <laughs> I think it looks good though. It does, I know. She had both. You got this full morning. volume. Great. Ben did great. We all did great. Ben, that was your first boat ride, and uh, we just we just Rocked threw you in there. You know, there's no idling. You know, in the Rackley family. It's just 40 mile an hour. No big deal. All right, we just got our first one. It was a crappie, surprisingly, at a school of white bass. I mean, wanted to touch it, so it's a little short. Oh, I just got another bite, Amy. Ooh. Might be time. Might be getting about that time to get your pole. It's still uh, a little early for the white bass to go in full school mode, but we're getting there. We're in a, like a long extended point, and they usually start going going crazy at sundown, but it starts about five o'clock. So got some fish movement. Never know what we're gonna get down there, do we, Amy? Yeah. It's a drum. Our second species. You want to touch a drum? Get you? It's a little slimy. We'll throw it back. It's kind of ugly. Huh? That's good though. Drums are a sign of Chad. Things speaking about Chad. We might have a first customer here. We do. I just I just saw the white bass on the screen. They have entered the scene. Okay, it's time for Amy. Here we go. They're showing up. Dinner bells are ringing. Okay, getting a few here and there. The fish are still really scattered. I'm waiting on that magic moment. A magic moment where three-year-olds can catch them easily. Kind of just spaced out. All about the same depth. They're starting to get on the bottom more, which is good. I want them just all together. 
You're just as happy playing with daddy's leftover plastics. Ooh, got him. That's a white bass. No, it's a drum. Thought I felt the power. Look how goofy this fish looks, Emmy. Look how goofy he is. Look at me. Goofy. Goofy. Yeah. Looks goofy, doesn't he? You want to see it swimming? Well, they're down there. They're, they're on my iPad. Just popped it off the ledge and I got a I got a large mouth on. That was crazy. Oh my god, look at this fish. Oh my god, look at the look at the size. Oh my god, this is huge. Emmy, this is a giant fish. Oh, oh my gosh. This fish is bigger than you, Emmy. What? Yeah. Oh yeah. What is it? A gar? Some sort of like drum thing what? drum carp yeah. thing you see it yet? it's big get ready daddy might need the net for this one. Whoa, where's the net? Oh my goodness he's just taking line where's the net oh it's it's under the boat we'll figure it out oh Amy oh my goodness it's fighting so hard This might be a shark. What's it gonna be? This could be a squid. It might be a whale. <laughs> it could be a whale. It could be anything. Look how big that is, hey? Oh my what? goodness. It's a Gasper goo. I don't think I've ever seen you catch one of those before. Uh, that's a big one. What is that? That is a buffalo carp. The old buff, as we like to call them. Oh, Amy, look how big that fish is. Got him in the net. I got him in the net, Emmy. He's so heavy I can barely lift him. That fish is like 20 pounds. Yeah, let me help you. We gotta get the hook out. Oh. I helped you. Look at that. Oh my gosh. His mouth is moving. He's got a mouth like a little sucker, huh? It does. It looks like a squid mouth. Okay. Got her lure out. Really heavy. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Uh -oh. Sorry. Sorry, Mom. <laughs> Got on your bag. It's a big gooey fish. Oh. All right, let's put him back. You, you ready, Ben? He's all slimy. Ah! There he goes. You got my camera all slimy. You <laughs> got the camera. Like, what? There's like five fish there. What the heck is going on? Hi, Dad. Well, Amy, they're just not showing up, are they? Uh, no. I feel like a daddy failure as a daddy dangler today. Couldn't put the kids on them. Huh? Just so spread out. Not good. All right, guys. I just I just found like a really weird school of crappie out here in the middle of the lake. It's crazy. Like I've never fished this spot before. I thought it was white bass and stuff the boat, and it turns out it's crappie. Just got a keeper, so well, I'm gonna cast in there one more time. If I get three in a row, I'm gonna get Amy up here and try to get one of these. Tip tapped it. Tip tapped it. I bet they would eat that little spoon. Amy's got tied on. Comes that same fish. Got him. I mean, they're fairly aggressive. Most of them are small, but perfect Emmy sized fish. Emmy, you want to catch one? You've got, okay. You've got your veggie fries organized and you're eating them. You got him, Emmy. Crappie time! Whoa, on your fishing pole. Look at that! He ate your rainbow lure you picked out. 
Isn't that cool? It's a little small, so we can't keep them, but pretty fun. I bet you if you dropped it down there, you'd get one. Okay. We're behind us just a little bit. Daddy's got to move the boat. Just hang on. That's never good. Oh boy. Here you go, Amy. Reel it in. Reel it. Did you get it? Reel it. Did you get it? I think there's something on there. What is it? What's gonna be on there? You gonna get them in? They're gonna be fast. Are you gonna let the fish win or are you gonna win? I'm gonna win. You got it, Amy girl. Oh my goodness, you got a white bass. It's your first one. Yeah. Good job, Amy. You got him. Yeah. You know what? Someone else has caught him before because he's missing an eye. Oh my gosh, he's got one eyeball. Yep. You gotta hold him in the mouth. Hold him like that. Um, you don't have to though. You don't have to. You wanna let him go? Or you want daddy to let him go? Yeah. Okay. Where is Okay, Amy. Real, real, real. Amy. All right, reel them in. Who's gonna win? Amy, you're the fish. He's pulling. He's trying to pull you in. I see him. What do we got? We got a drum. That's your first drum. He's wiggly. You just caught your first white bass and your first drum on your rainbow spoon. Isn't that cool? Say bye bye. Bye bye. It's kind of silly, doesn't it? All right, you want to reel in another one? <laughs> Not too excited about it? Okay, daddy will, daddy will reel them in, don't worry. All right, the rest of these are pretty tiny. Amy, we'll be back. You don't, you don't, you don't want to go. You like it out here? All right, quick photo. Mom, ready? Here we go. This way. Yeah, this way's fine. I'm not going. Why not, Amy girl? Really quick. Amy, one, two, three. This is a really sad moment. I'm sorry that you didn't do that. I mean, you wouldn't even take a picture of the crappie with me. That just hurts Dad's feelings. Well, Mr. Ben, it's time for your bath. Yeah. <laughs> did you have fun? I think he had fun. I think he did. He didn't Amy, cry once. Amy's Amy, what's the fun done. factor? <laughs> I think she's done. <laughs> she, she looks like me. <laughs> yeah, I've seen that face before somewhere. <laughs> Don't know where I've seen it. But Probably when the fruit has run out and I'm just tired. Yeah, I remember the one time I was frog fishing until dark. And I was, well, and from sun up it. till sundown. And it was and I full was day done. dangle. All right, you take the kiddos. <laughs> and I'll go load the boat, Bubba. We'll get you on them one day, don't worry. Yeah. All righty, Roo. All done for the day. Took the family out, you know, I'm not gonna call it unsuccessful, but it wasn't how I dreamed about it. So I think we'll be back definitely to get on the mega schools. It's just, I mean, just recently they were popping up, just going crazy on top. And I was like, I gotta get, I gotta get Amy out here. You know, she's gonna, she's gonna love it. Instead, they, they got scattered, they got deep and um, it became difficult. We're just gonna have to do it another day. But when I came into the boat ramp, I had, fishing freaks at the dock and just at one other fishing spot and uh, anyway got to hang out with them and uh, 
take some pictures with them. And I was like, man, my daughter didn't even want to take a picture with me today with a crappie. And I've got, you know, people I've never met before that watch my videos that, that want to hang out with me. So anyway, that that's that's something that maybe she'll learn one day. She's going to be like uh, talking to her friends at school about how her dad is like a weird old like YouTube guy back when YouTube was a thing doing fishing videos. But yeah, let's see. Let's see what the future holds. And I suppose we will shut it down right here, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me and the family on the water today. Very special video today. I want to thank MTB for sponsoring today's video. And also, if you guys want to check out the new summer merch that just launched, a lot of new patterns, really good stuff, and new shorts, apparently. I, I don't even know if these are available yet, but the most comfortable shorts I've ever put on in my life. They have liners that are the same material as our performance long sleeves makes a difference. Make sure to smash that like button for family fishing. God bless you, Godspeed, and I'll see you guys on the next one. We gotta be real careful not to hit ourselves or hit daddy with this one. Last time you were using one hook, now we got three hooks on here. Three hooks. <laughs>